Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Hello, if you are new here, comment below. Let me know, are you feeling festive yet? Because it is basically Christmas. Literally, it's almost Christmas. How scary is that? Where has the time gone? So today, I am here with the coziest, comfiest, autumn, winter, slash festive H&M haul. I have spent so much money at H&M recently. I bought loads of homeware, which you'll see in my moving vlogs, and I also bought lots of clothes as well. So I think you're gonna like this. I got 20% off everything on Black Friday as well. <gasps> I'm so excited to show you. So without further ado, do get cozy and let's get hauling. So first things first, this red oversized coat. You might think I look like Postman Pat, but if you follow me on Instagram, you will know I am a fan of red. Also, my red doll nails, Leeds Girls, they are also red. I'm just loving red. It feels so festive, so Christmassy, and I thought this coat was really smart. It was really affordable too. In fact, all of this haul was affordable. H&M have upped their game so, so, so much. Do comment and let me know your thoughts on H&M. I just think it's nice because it's kind of tailored, kind of fitted in the right places, but then it's just comfy. But yeah, yeah, no, I really like the colour, I like the style, I like the way that it fits and I just think it's a really easy to wear coat. I think it goes with everything as well, which is always a bonus. I like coats I can just like throw over anything and just wear them all the time. Next up, are we taking this animal print trend too far? So we've got snake skin, which I'm still definitely not fully on board with. We've got leopard print and now we have, I don't know if this is zebra or tiger, what do you guys think? But the coat is very nice, but I ordered it because I thought, hmm, why not give another kind of print a try? My outfit is usually quite boring and I probably need to steer away from how much leopard print I have. So I've just popped this with literally a plain black outfit and my Gucci belt. The coat actually fits nicely, it's just on my arms, it's a little bit short, which is weird because I do not have long arms. I'm a very short person, but hey, it doesn't matter. You just put like a nice knit underneath it and then you're not gonna be cold. It feels weird, but I think it looks nice and it's obviously faux fur. I don't know, it is really comfortable. It's very well made. It's got kind of like a faux suede thing inside and then fastened up. I think it's a very smart coat. Let's show you it fastened up. I do think it's smart and I think it would look really nice over like a little black dress over Christmas time. What do you guys think? I think it goes nice with red as well. It depends if you're into animal print, but it's the way that it fits. I think it's nice because it's kind of not too tight. Just easy to wear. And the Christmas festive fairy. Is this way too festive? Talk to me guys. Are we into Christmas jumpers? I am because I love every season and of course I love Christmas time. I love this. I am very partial, very, very partial to a jumper dress as it is. So comfortable, so easy to wear. Take you from day to night. Can be worn with trainers, knee highs, heels, whatever. Totally acceptable throughout the festive season as well. And I love this one. So give me your thoughts. Scores on the door. Literally a festive Christmas jumper jumper dress. Is there anything more perfect? I don't think so. Don't worry guys, I have got your back. If the last one was a bit too festive or bright for you, here we go. I have got the perfect jumper dress because it is oversized, it's super comfy, and it's a roll neck as well, meaning one, you don't need a scarf, and two, it covers up all of my fake tan disasters. Also love the colour. It feels so soft, but not itchy soft. Love it with knee highs. I love that it's just like baggy and just throw on and then you are good to go. You could always throw on a leather jacket with it if you do want to smarten it up. I think this is a reason I love jumper dresses so much. They're so versatile. You can land around the house in them. You can go for date night in them. You can go for drinks with your friends in them. You can go to a Christmas market in them or you can open Christmas presents in them. You can literally do everything. So I thought it was nice with a leather jacket as well. Next up, it wouldn't be an M haul without some leopard print. So I got this leopard print dress, which is a midi. And sometimes I think midis are a little bit too old for me, but I think they're really classy and I think they're really nice and easy to wear. And you could always whack it on with like a bralette or something like that if you want to make it a bit more like night outy. I popped it with my knee highs. And then I've also popped it with this jumper that I also got from H&M, very itchy. Now this is on the itchy side. This is the kind of thing that my mom would return immediately because it's itchy, but I think it looks really nice. It didn't look nice on the website. It was almost too oversized and I was like, hmm, I'm gonna risk it. I mean, I don't know what these balloon sleeves are, but I like the color and I do think it looks nice tucked into a little skirt. I don't know what are your thoughts on the skirt, but I actually love leopard print. As you guys know, I do not need to keep any more leopard print, but I thought I would try it because it was really affordable and I just think it's a really cute little easy skirt to wear, whether it's work or after work drinks. You get the drill. Shock. <laughs> 
it's versatile. Next up, I don't think I own a dark brown jumper. This is new in my wardrobe. You guys probably know by now that I love roll necks slash turtlenecks. I don't know the difference. Basically just something that covers my neck because my neck tan is never the same as my face tan. Let's be honest, you have got your life together if you can match your face and your neck because my face is never as orange as my neck until I'm using my Instagram filter. Love this. It's comfortable. The material is so soft. It feels felt-like. It's kind of brown with like ready vibes inside it and it's just like slit down the side. It's such an easy to wear kind of boxy fit jumper. I just love comfy jumpers. You can wear them with leggings. You feel so, so, so nice wearing them with leggings, Gymshark leggings. If you didn't watch my haul, watch it below. The kit is so, so, so good. I'm very impressed. I will be living in those leggings. I'm gonna be one of those girls that isn't actually going to the gym, but is just in gym kit. Anyway, leggings would look good with this. Jeans, a little skirt, shock, leopard print. Obviously, this is a kind of down, but then you can tuck it in. I always tuck jumpers in. Does anyone else do that? Knee highs, wear it with whatever. It's just a really nice, versatile jumper. And I just really like the colour, actually, because it's not black. A lot of my wardrobe is black. It's still quite nice and autumnal and neutral without me being boring and just wearing everything black. So I'm going to try it with two different coats now that are also from H&M to show you because H&M's coat game is seriously strong. When I get excited, I talk too fast. I need to slow that tempo down, just have a word with myself. So first things first, I actually thought this was a coat, but it's definitely more of a cardigan. It's very thin, but it's very comfortable. I feel like one of those cute bears that you see going viral. Yep, right, let's go. Let's try this. Do I just look like a, a Pokemon? What's that Pokemon called that's like the Jigglypuff? <laughs> Jigglypuff, again, does not fit my arms. Do I just have really long arms? Because I definitely don't. It's very cropped. Do you know how I feel about cropped things? But obviously it was fluffy, so Em was like, I've got to have it. I always panic order fluffy things. Don't need them. My boyfriend actually said to me, if I bring anything else into the house that's faux fur or fluffy, it's not allowed in. Well, sorry, because it's coming in. But yeah, I just thought it was nice to wear. Actually, probably with jeans. I think this would look good with like an all black outfit. The next one I got, now just a little disclaimer, I'm not gonna keep this one because I have a very similar one from Topshop, which I love so much. It's in the sale at the moment. I'll link all of these outfits below, by the way, underneath this video. But this is very similar. And so I wanted to try it in case my Topshop one sells out because I'm sure it will. And then I needed to find an alternative. And I just thought this was really nice and it was actually quite affordable. H&M this year have done so many good faux faux jackets. Every time I try them, I'm like, Dan, you are good. Like H&M's always been good, but they've just upped their quality and upped their style. And it's something that I always forget about to go shopping. And now I'm like, oh, you are good. So yeah, I like this. I much prefer it to the Jigglypuff Pokemon coat. What do you guys think? I was not lying when I said this is a festive haul. So if you don't like Christmas jumpers, I'm sorry, but I thought this was so cute. I thought it said Switzerland on it, but it says Winterland. Not that I wanted it to say Switzerland, but it's cute. Winterland with a love heart. How adorable. It makes me just want to go to a chalet in the Alps. If anyone can recommend any cute chalets, hit me up. I just want to do something cute where I like wear cozy things like this. This is the first year that I've not been abroad to any Christmas markets. And this gives me all of those kind of mulled wine, Christmas market vibes. Does everyone, does anyone feel me? Does anyone like Christmas markets? Because I love them. Mainly because there's food and mulled wine, but I can also wear jumpers like this. So yeah, I feel like this is a perfect Christmas day jumper. It's small, it's nice, but it's still amazingly festive and it's very comfy. Itch factor, not actually itchy and it kind of covers my neck. Another jumper, but I think the reason I love autumn winter weather is because it is jumper season and I love jumpers. If you're from America, I think you say sweaters or sweatshirts. Can you let me know in the comments? Because I know lots of you guys aren't from the UK. I love that we have a global M. Shell family now. I love you guys and reading your comments. I keep going off on a tangent today. I'm chatty. This is so comfortable. It's not as good quality as the others. I'm not gonna lie. This is from the Divided range, which is more affordable than the other H&M stuff. And I think H&M goes from like one degree to another. You've got their kind of Divided range which is very affordable and then you've got some other ranges that go to like quite looks. This looks really nice, it feels really nice but it's just not the best quality but it's a really easy one that you can throw over your leggings, pop some wellies on, go on a nice little winter walk. This is where I wish I had a cozy dog to take on a walk with me. Maybe I need to just borrow someone's dog. If you guys have a dog that I can walk let me know. So last but not least, sorry guys this is a lot more festive than I remembered. I was clearly having a lot of more wine when placing this order and listening to Christmas songs. I actually put Mariah Carey on the other day. I was like 
like loving those vibes. Um, I love this one, it's got reindeers on. The eyes are beaded, I did not realise. Did not expect to touch the eyes and then be beaded. How cute is that? Have you ever seen a cute Christmas jumper? How much do you guys hate me right now? I've been so annoying. But how cute is this? I love that it's just like not as serious. It's just, it's nice to just wear a cute Christmassy jumper. I'm definitely gonna keep this one, mainly because they've got beaded eyes. Oh my God, all the way around as well. H&M, that is good quality. It's a yes from me. Obviously you don't have to wear the denim skirt and knee highs. I'm just being a bit lazy, but whack it on with leggings or jeans and order it so you can see that they've got actual eyes. That is so cute, I love reindeers. Okay guys, so there we have it. Thank you so, so, so much for watching this haul. I really hope you liked it. If you did, pretty please come and click the subscribe button and come say hello on Instagram and Twitter at mshellx. I would love, love, love you guys to let me know what you'd like me to film because I love hearing your suggestions. Thank you so much guys, see you soon.